Hello, uh, this is example 3.6.1 from page 143 of the Duffy and Beckman text. So this problem uh, is about the sun, which is um, 5,777 Kelvin black body radiator. Um, and we are asked to find the wavelength, or lambda, the wavelength at which the maximum monochromatic emissive power occurs. Um, and um, this uh, part of the, the question um, is solved by Wien's displacement law. Uh, which states that um, the maximum wavelength um, times the temperature of the black body radiator is equal to 2,897.8 micrometers Kelvin. So divided by T on both sides, um, therefore lambda max is equal to 2,897.8 divided by 5777, uh, which is 0 0.502 micrometers. So that is the wavelength at which maximum power occurs. Um, so building into the second part of the problem, um, Let's just draw what this looks like. Um, so this is wavelength, and this is uh, power. Um, the distribution of solar energy looks something like that. And so what it's saying is that at this point, that happens at 0, at 0 0.5 micrometers. So um, if this is problem A, um, problem B uh, asks um, a second question about this same situation. It asks, uh, what is the energy fraction from this source that's in the visible frequency range? So, um, Uh, we find these fractional values in uh, table 3.6.1a. Um, um, and, and what this is asking, um, the visible frequency range is from 0 0.38 micrometers up to 0 0.78 micrometers. So in this graphic, that's um, given by a range like that. We're trying to figure out what is going on in between there. So from the table, we want to find what lambda t is. So 0 0.38 times 5777 gives us 2195 and 0 0.78.
times the temperature of the black body radiator is 4506. So with both of these numbers, uh, you can now look it up in table 3.6.1a. and um, obtain the fraction of energy from zero up to that wavelength. So in the case of the first one, it's 10%. And in the case of the second one, it's 56% from that table. So therefore, we can figure out our answer of F viz, the visible uh, frequencies, uh, which is simply 56% minus 10% um, 0.46 which is 46% of total energy um, in and again put the answer in a box so that it's clear uh, what we've done um, and that's that so thank you for listening and uh, uh, that's problem 3.6.1